All right, so how about we all introduce our families, starting with Mike, because his family is the circus family, which is cool. So just give us their names, and then something, something, it's like an icebreaker, something we want, we should know about them. Oh, um, the Sinister Rigmaster is Darius Dark. Uh, the carnival is in Dark's blood, and there is quite a lot of blood in his carnival. That's gross. <laughs> Um, Mr. Giggles, the creepy clown. Yeah. Mr. Giggles always has a smile for the children. So, of note, Mr. Giggles is who I'm going to be putting all my good cards on. <laughs> because if anyone deserves a happy life, it's Mr. It's Giggles. Mr. Giggles. That's, yep. that's um, his name. So just so you guys know, that's what we should all do. I agree. Yeah. Samson O'Toole, the bearded man. I don't okay. know why that's so special. He's but got like just a neck beard, though. Yeah, it's, it's true. It's, it's like, like a it's every like a high school yeah. teenage boy ever. <laughs> well, bearded ladies are always popular. Few people seem interested in Samson's remarkable deformity. Yeah. Um, right. Thumbelisa, the diminutive diva, uh, Darius <laughs> Dark would have been wiser to promote Thumbelisa. Minute size, minute size instead of her mediocre opera talents. Minute size. Oh, minute size. Bridge Triggets, thank you so much for the follow. We appreciate it. Welcome to the goddamn table. My family table. are the Wellington Smythe family, and his wife is dead. My guy is dumbfounded Duke, Lord Wellington Smythe. His wife's dead. That's a fact you can know about him. We have Lola Wellington Smythe. She's the wild child. She apparently has danced with the de devil and played dice with death, which is, I guess, fun. We have the twins, who no one has names in my, I mean, Lola has a name, I don't know what I'm talking about. We have the twins, which are twins. Um, <laughs> what? But they don't get their own card, because fuck them. They're both yeah. the same card. Well, because they're like... Because they're twins. They're, they're actually, like the creepy... They're, they're, they're attached, yeah, they're, they're conjoined they're, twins. There's twins at the end of and, the hallway in The Shining. Yes, <laughs> except now one's a boy. Wow. And then we got Butterfle Butterfield, the lurking butler, whatever it is, he did it. So he is the one behind Donald Trump getting to presidency. I've He's the one who hacked the election. Shining. Man, that's good, it's good. You should see it. That's good. I've I mean, never seen the movie. To be fair, it's very I different. Judge too harsh. I hadn't seen it until like two years ago. So. No, that's all you need. As soon as you've seen <laughs> it, you can judge anybody <laughs> that hasn't seen it. Uh, Megan, who's your family? Uh, I have the Blackwater clan. Uh, that's the scary. Old, oh, you're pirates? There's uh, there's a, a pirate equivalent. Okay. Uh, we got we got the old dam, the murderous matriarch. She rules the Blackwater clan. Um, she's a badass bitch. Um, and then we've got a Willem Stark. Uh, the disturbing handyman, who, uh, he basically takes care of business. Um, then Cousin Mordecai, who's the red-headed stepchild, and his description is my favorite because it says inbreeding is the least of his worries. <laughs> so is this then implied that he has been inbred or he wants to inbreed? Oh, is it both? I think it's a little from Colby. <laughs> <Colby. laughs> yeah. yeah. And then of course Balthazar, that is uh, the lovely dog of the family, and he knows where all the bones are buried. Yeah. Kaylin, uh, finish right. us off. I've got uh, Professor Helena Slugger. Um, she enjoys gardening, long walks in the moonlight, and re reanimating the dead. Sick. Um, and then I've got Lord Slugger, who is literally a brain in the box, <laughs> and we're assuming that Professor Helena Slugger um, put him in there. Yes. Yeah. Um, and mm -hmm. she assures us that his heart is in the right place. <laughs> uh, Melissa Slogger is a cadaverous child. She's dead. Um, and, <laughs> and Grogger, uh, he's a work in progress, and it's Professor Slogger. Uh, she's determined to, to give her daughter a groom, even if it's a teddy bear with a brain. Crazy. Sick. All right, so I want to play some Schwatzy to see who's going to go first. Everybody get ready to watch Mike or Justin win. Ooh, double purple, Mike. Double purple. No, oh, wait. Ooh. <laughs> no, white purple. We'll just sit over here and wait for them to be done playing. Trying to stay out of it, really. Ah! It serves Randy you right. Game Club, thank you so much for the cheer. Mike, you Beep. go first. Serves you right for taking my purple. Beep. You were going to yeah, win anyway. We'll go like this. I don't know And then we'll go like that. Nice. Yeah. All right, Mike. Meek. Meek. Meek, Meek And remember to tell your story. Got a great story, Mike. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. So that's the only, that's the, that's the only reason. Straight. Straight. <laughs> <laughs> I even had a nap today, and I'm like, just, oh, uh, This nutty. is probably, what, 14 days straight? I don't even know. I did the straight? install, and then I did the festival, and then I did the strike. So I'm probably riding on close to a month now. Like, real close. <laughs> She's losing it just a little. <laughs> um, I'm going to play a card on somebody else. Ooh, he's immediately... <laughs> 
making enemies. Immediately making enemies. Um, uh, do I have to say, say the story? Yes. Okay. Yep. So yep. we're going to say that the professor... The fuck? In, in her attempts to make the groom for the daughter, wanted to bl get him blessed by the bishop. So it was okay. Have you seen her? I doubt she's blessing anything. Uh, so, Caitlin, you may do the action, which is you may discard any number of cards from your hand and then draw back up to your hand size. So now this bear is very happy. <laughs> Super it. happy bear. Yeah. Extremely happy. happy. Bear. <laughs> With his brain sticking out. Mike, you can take a second action while she's doing this. I as well. can, yes. Um, my. Uh, Cards are starting. Samson O'Toole and him being not very interesting to to patrons of the circus decided to maybe become part more handyman in the circus and he was wandering around and actually got wounded I found a wasp nest and got wounded by wasps. Oh man, that sucks. Now uh, you gonna draw back up to five, Mike? All right, picture this, everybody. Um, Lord Wellington Smythe was in the garden. Sad and depressed over his dead wife, who actually died like 14 years ago, so he, he needs to get over it. Yeah. Where he had, a, uh, he was just pruning the bushes in the garden, and it was a just a rainy day, and he didn't notice that there was an army of porcupines making their way up the back way. An army? Oh, army. They were, you know, clad in armor and yes. everything. <laughs> whatever malicious... <laughs> Whatever malicious <laughs> intent they had was lost onto him, for he was too busy crying over some weeping willows, which were in fact his wife's favorite plant. And poor old Lord Wellington Smythe was pierced by porcupines. And now he's sad. Yeah. Gotta go to the vet to get that shit taken out. Mm -hmm. And then if there's one thing I know about good old cousin Mordecai... Oh no. ...is that... People love him. We can't really know why people love Cousin Mordecai. Maybe it's the small fish he's hold, holding. Maybe it's the fact that he always talks about inbreeding. It's <laughs> maybe a, it's his red hair. You yeah, yeah, maybe it's the red hair. But he is the toast of the town. Oh, no. So your hand side is increased by one. And I'll draw two cards and end my turn. Oh, snappies. Okay. Well. I guess... The first things first uh, would be, since, you know, Cousin Mordecai is so popular now, um, he, he, they, the town threw him a parade, and uh, he was paraded through town, um, but unfortunately they rounded a rather shady corner, and uh, there was a group of downtrodden people who were asking for money, and, you know, being the nice guy that the town wanted him to be, he, he's, he gave them some spare change, and they got a little frisky, and he was beaten by beggars. Oh, no. Yeah, Goodness. just poor, poor Mordecai. Poor Mr. Mordecai. Um, and then, um, you know, since, since the twins had each other, they were passing the time by playing cards. some cards, and Ooh, they were real draw, good at it. Draw one card. Just made them super happy. Yeah, you know what? The kids, the twins do like cards because there's always someone to play against. There always is. There always. They got friends, you know? My family's in town for the last week, so I'm an MIA. You know, that makes sense. I haven't seen you around, so that checks out. Shonders, GR Cabal, how the hell's it going? Uh, and your hand limit's six now. Oh, no, you got rid of that. I Never got mind. rid of it. <laughs> that was the first order of business. Yeah. <laughs> Get back to zero. <laughs> Poor old cousin Mordecai. Yeah. He didn't like people talking about him. Well, okay. One. So while uh, while Grover was was being blessed, mm -hmm. um, the church collapsed. <gasps> oh shit! And he was crushed by the church. <laughs> Man, that sucks for Grogar. Mm -hmm. You know he's a teddy bear. He's a teddy bear. Probably didn't. I think he's gonna be much. fine. Well, I mean, like the brain probably felt fear. Uh, uh, yeah, maybe. Yeah. Maybe pain. You yeah. know. I'm not sure how this reanimation crap works. Really. Yeah, that's, <laughs> as, as far as my opinion, this is sacrilege. Yeah. It, it, uh, this fan, the Lord Wellington, the Wellington Smythe family does not like that. Not a, a and now, uh, Lord Slogger, he's, uh, he's bored. Yeah, I don't blame him. But uh, his lovely wife, Helena, is kind, and she's connected him to the network. <laughs> <laughs> So he's uh, he's started yeah. embezzling money. Does he? Have, does he have Wi-Fi in there? <laughs> he doesn't need Wi-Fi. He's hardwired in. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so he stole money, 
From from a dead guy. Nice. Yeah. Uh, so you only draw one card. Correct. Cool. Well, it's good to see you, OC Brad. Brad. You're my little guardian angel. Uh, so I'm going to play on top of an Christmas event tree. card. Ooh. Oh my God. I'm going to draw four cards and play one as a free action and then discard my hand back down to my draw limit. Cool. Get those plastic agendas and yeah, that's exactly mm. what they smell like. Oh man, I, I smell way too much there. <laughs> I guess I can play any card from it, but I think I'm gonna play this one. Um, so, Thanks, Brad. Um, you don't have cash, right? Yeah, you don't. No, I don't have cash. Make sure. <laughs> he calls it a shirt dress. Not that he can see what's. Can't see the bottom there. <laughs> the uh, Wilhelm Stark. Oh, Wilhelm Stark. Wilhelm Stark. Wilhelm Stark. No. Decided to uh, come see the circuits. Okay, well, yeah, he would. And um, there. <laughs> he was very charmed and amused by all the blood the and circus things, you and know, the bearded man especially. He probably yeah. would like that. Yeah, I don't even argue. He like he's a beard. He liked the bearded man. So <laughs> now you just go down to five. Mike. Now I just go down to five, and then I get like one more. Time. That would be nice. Uh, one. They made beard love. And your family's pretty two. happy. Just ten. Just go Just those ten. two. Okay. Everybody else is a zero. Yeah. That's okay. I mean, to me, this is the only guy in your family. So, yeah. <laughs> He's the pirate. Only that matters, yeah. really. Um, and for me, the Balthazar is the only one who really counts. I that's mean, true. He's a dog. He's a dog, so. Well, uh, Samson O'Toole was uh, doing maintenance work, and he found the wasp nest. Something came out. We don't know what yet, but at this point, he was torn. Oh, uh, you can't die as a second action. You have to do what? it first. It's got to be a first unless action. You, oh, unless fuck, you that's have right. A, something that's a free action. A free action. I just didn't, yeah. But. So he's planning on killing Samson. <laughs> oh, make him real happy real fast. Justin, can you elevator pitch this game? Sure. Everyone has a family, and we're going to take turns playing cards that can either modify their happiness or their sadness. The point of the game is to have your family die the most depressing death while having a miserable life and then being forgotten, hopefully. Mm -hmm. So cards have either a positive or a negative modifier, and you can play them on either your own people or other people's people, and it's kind of a storytelling game. Yeah. So. Uh, Darius Dark, um, while doing circus things and events at the circus, accidentally did some sort of ritual. And he, some, somehow, uh, Pumped all that blood, you never know. <laughs> somehow, uh, summoned some poltergeists and oh, he sweet. started getting pestered by them constantly. They did not, they didn't go away. Fuckers. Pestered by poltergeists. And so I need to give two cards to the per, from your, of my choice to the person on my right. Sick. I think I'm going to do that, those two. Two, three. All right. Alright, so I'm in a bit of a pickle. So, I'm um, gonna... I have two cards that are affected by these Yeah, I have some there yeah. too. Yeah. yeah, so they do change yeah. it. Yeah, I got, I got multiples shit. too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just couldn't remember at the beginning what they did. Yeah. Oh. That's awesome. Astrogeists. Um, Alright, so I'm gonna choose an untimely death card from the discard pile and play it on a living character that either has a heart icon or a negative self self worth score. Oh, there you so go. I'm gonna get this happy was baked into a pie. And does anyone have no? No one has the heart symbol, but that's okay because Lord Wellington Smith is fucking baked into a pie. <laughs> that sucks for him because <laughs> his wife loved pies. So, I mean, actually, that's probably good, because now it's like they're together again. Aww. Okay, now, so... It's no longer sad. End game is first person to kill off all their people. Everybody has one final round. Is that correct? Yeah, that's um, familiar. The game ends the instant the last character in a family dies. Oh, so we're just... Oh, so until somebody kills yeah. off everyone. So the race is on. Um... Imaginary friend, choose one living character from a family of your choice and remove it from the game. Then remove this card from the game. <laughs> Darius Dark what? traveled a lot in the circus. 
Right, well, I mean, you can't, you can't get rid of the going. ringmaster. <laughs> There's no circus without the ringmaster. That's the point. The circus moves on. But the other three though. got really attached to this city, and they thought, you know what? I'm going to stay here forever. Darius Dark, however, vanishes and was never seen again. Maybe we just put it on top. Sure. I going to say rip, but you know, that's worse than rip at this point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's no points. That's, that's no points. That's, that's it. That's it for me. Okay. Hmm. The one ringmaster to rule them all. <laughs> okay, so Mordecai, because he's my favorite one to pick on, um, and he's holding a salmon, which, you know, he, he went fishing and he caught this fish that he's holding in this lovely little picture. Um, and because he's who he is, he didn't cook it quite so right, you know, he just didn't. And so the day after eating this salmon, he found out he was sickened by it. Sickened by salmon? Sickened by salmon. Ooh, that's a huge modifier. Yeah. Discard one card from your hand every time you play a modifier card, including this one. Yep. Yeah. So I have to discard one of my cards currently. Super, super rop. Super rip. Fell down a well. And your second action? Is this going to go on poor Mordecai again? <laughs> I don't know yet. <laughs> trying to decide. I think so. It's because it's of his hair, no. isn't it? It's because it's of his, his hair. hair. Uh... <sighs> oh, gosh. No, I think I better make Willem Stark less happy. He's, a, he's just a little... He's just enjoying life too just happy. a little too much. Tush, tush! How's it Hello. going, tush, tush? Hello, Canada. Hello, all of Canada. Uh, okay, so Willem Stark, uh, he, after going to the circus and watching all these weird, strange, blood-infested rituals that apparently happen in this circus... <laughs> He went home and he started to feel ill. In fact, he went to the doctor and he found out he'd contracted consumption. <laughs> oh no. From the circus? <laughs> yeah. That makes sense. <laughs> and your draw limit is decreased by one. And you discard one card from your hand. Yep. <laughs> and then you draw back up to four. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Why are you targeting her? Yeah. Lady uh, Wellington Smythe. She's a, she's a wild child. But she didn't live. Quite wild enough. Oh, she's not negative. You can't play it on. Oh, yeah. that's correct. Well, I guess. <laughs> Just get Mike out of this game. <laughs> Please don't. Oh man, kill the fucking uh, inbred or the pirate. Oh, I may have to kill the pirate. Kill the pirate. I, yeah. I have to Go kill ahead. the pirate. Go ahead. Go oh, ahead. Died that's without rough. cares. That's because no he was had consumption. Well, you know. He forgot about all his worries. All his worries. He's just like, I'm gonna die. All right, accept it. Just like, man, I feel ill. I have a single beard hair within my vision under my left eye. That sucks. You know, this is that scissors. Yeah, cut out your eye. Yeah, <laughs> spoons do better for that. Man, there was a Criminal Minds episode about a killer that kept people's eyeballs and just like didn't kill them exactly, but scooped out their eyeballs and just waited for them to die. Oh, yeah. Like that. It Welcome was a very creepy episode. Welcome to fucking hell. It will haunt me for the rest yeah. of my days. <laughs> um, oh, I'm gonna... <laughs> the is is here. Welcome, is. Welcome to the goddamn golden table. Not No, just gold, just regular table. So, uh... Okay, I'm having problems. <laughs> Lord, uh, Lord Slaughter. to the club. Um, like, we gotta start making hers a bit positive, but you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. Really I gotta work on mine first here. He You're uh, out of the game, Mike. You only have three yeah. people. <laughs> In the net, you know, Not he, true. Made his, he made his way to some, uh, some dark corners of the internet. Ooh. He was marooned on the moors on some, you know, weird some, RPG like we're, role Yeah, we're some Pirates, Scotland yeah. RPG. Uh, <laughs> I may play, if this character has a negative self-worth, I may play a death card as a free play. Ooh. Oh, seems good. Um, mm. Solid. Stop giving away the golden table. I know, I'll just give it to anybody. <laughs> do, 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 do. And I'm going to play... Neither of these helps me. So I'll just play... You don't have to play a death card if you don't want I to. I do want to. I'm just trying to decide which one works for my character, Megan. Sorry. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna play this one and his uh, his boss. 
push downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> By the teddy bear, clearly, because yeah. that would be the best. Just. All right. All right. Oh, and I guess I can draw. Work. All right, Samson O'Toole. Yes. Is it time for him to die now? Um. Well, he was trying to get rid of the wasp nest when he was wounded by the wasps. Something got him. Something dragged him away from. Just will you mail me a the table not made the of circus gold. anymore from his their new place in not the city the circus. into the forest. They got dragged away and was torn, found torn oh. limb from limb. Oh, nice. That's really good because he has the bat. He does have the bat. Uh, I will give you if you anyone who subs for one year in a row, we will make you a little tiny table and paint it gold and send it to you. A hundred percent. No, no, no. All right, there we go. That's good. I was worried that he'd say no, but no, I like that idea. 100%. Oh, but only the first person who reaches. No, I think like in a, in the first ten people. First get ten. People, get a golden table. Yeah, sure. First ten. The ten golden tables. To do. What's your second action, Mike? My second action right. is. Year straight? Can yep. you do that? Oh, yeah. Because, like, for example, in, I'm just, these guys are two months. Right. You just have to make sure like, don't miss, don't let oh, it right. lose. Here and that, you can yeah. just, like, <laughs> that's the word I'm looking for. <laughs> yeah. um, subscription and pay for it all at once. You could. You can play for six months at a time, but we don't see that. Yeah. Oh, we can't see that. We, right. it, it charges they, each month. It charges each month, and they, they'll click their sub button, and it'll, it'll alert us, but yeah. This time next year, we're going to be mailing out a bunch of little golden tables. Ten, Ten of them. them. The ten golden tables. Uh, Mr. Giggles. Ooh. <gasps> Forget about him. <laughs> um, decided after the ringmaster left, he decided to go on a holiday. Seems good. Solid. Um, but he actually had a very horrible holiday. Oh shit! That's fine. That's forty. Discard your hand. Whoa. Also, skip your skip your draw phase this turn. No cards for you. Man, you only get a turn next turn. He also didn't really get a turn this turn. He only got to play one, right? Two. I killed off him. Oh, that's that. right. All right. You make this slightly worse, Mike, but that's okay. I'm going to play the Root of All Evil. Draw one card from each opponent's hand. If I control a character with the coin icon, I may play any of these cards for free. Nice. Do you control a character with the... You coin? Do. I'll take the blank ones because I don't want your effects. And I'll take this one. Oh, I can play them in this order. We'll make these twins a little bit worse. Starved in a storm. They were outside. I and... use that one. I'm sorry. Poor Melissa Slogger was going to be stuck outside. Luckily, the mm. twins were there to suffer a much more <laughs> miserable fate. Because no one likes being out in the rain. Nobody does. Where the, uh, the, ar nope. the army of porcupines are still <laughs> there. Still marching around. Somehow protecting the garden for some reason. <laughs> and then uh, because they, it was raining so much that they both slipped and fell into a puddle at the same time because they're conjoined. Right. And apparently they ran out of air. And they fucking drowned. They drowned in a puddle. That wow. sucks. That's that's a rough way to go. Real rough. By the way, I'm killing the butler last, probably. But he did it. He killed everybody else and then kills himself. Naturally. Yes. That's how it, yeah. that's how it works. Alright, <laughs> then what we're gonna do for this action was distressed by dysentery. Now it's not what you think. She doesn't actually have dysentery. Is actually the correct way to say that. Um, she was playing um, Lola Wellington Smith Smythe was playing Oregon Trail, and she made each one of her people and her dead mom um, a person. And unfortunately, her character was distressed by dysentery, and that's She's that. She's very distressed by a 1990s... So <laughs> then the player to your left may randomly and select, discard two cards from your hand, so I'm going to shuffle under here so I don't see them, and then just choose uh, one to three twice. Okay. Yeah, like so like choose two cards, two numbers... Two and three. <laughs> Alright, there we go. I'll draw four cards. That's it for me. Dissing Terry. She should be stressed. Dissing, yeah. Dissing Terry. How, how dare you diss Just Terry. Terry. Ah, so poor little Mordecai. <laughs> um, after his bad fish experience, he decided that he needed to learn how to cook things better. So he went to culinary school. And, That's good. <laughs> and uh, in culinary school, they were uh, working with barbecues. And he, you know, didn't quite get the hang of, of 
you know, flipping those burgers. It's just a, it's a hard thing to do. It is. And uh, he, he, he tripped, and he fell, and he landed right in the barbecue, and he was, he was badly burned. Oh, God, no, that poor guy! Yeah, yeah, just so sad. And, uh... Oh, I, worth an additional ten, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Sweet. That's so good. That's, that's, that's good you guys both have one of those, considering you're both down a person. <laughs> <just> <laughs> rough. <laughs> um... And then, poor Bal Balthazar, Balthazar, however I want to pronounce his name, <laughs> <laughs> the unfaithful hound, um, was uh, parading around the yard, um, sniffing bushes and stuff as dogs do, and uh, all of a sudden, an army, similar to the porcupines, probably of the same nature, not yeah. really sure where these armies are coming from, but of mice this time charged out at this poor dog and you know they climbed up all over him started biting it was just bad he was menaced by mice oh no perhaps the elephants know something we don't <laughs> yeah probably <laughs> shit my age man that's how you know time is ticking <laughs> when you roll a d100 and roll your age yeah <laughs> Shouldn't it be a militia of mice? Was menaced by mice. Yeah, that would make more sense to be a militia. A militia? You're right. Instead of an army? Instead of an army. I mean, I an army missed, of porcupines also would I missed a militia opportunity. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, poor Grogger. No, not Grogger. Was, uh, was under this collapsed church after he was just trying to get blessed. Just trying. It was clearly a little misunderstanding. Oh, that's not a death card. That's an event. No, oh, it is. It is an event. So I can play that second. Yep. Uh, <laughs> yep, can. Well. Mice militia. Mice militia. Mice militia. Mice militia. What happens to him now? He drowned in a bog. Cool. Clearly there was a bog under that church. Or outside of the church. And clearly I need to read these cards before I start playing. <laughs> <laughs> No, you're just focused on the goal of killing people. I am, which yeah, is the, really. Which is what you're supposed and to do. And telling stories. I am yeah. focused, so. Um, and then Melissa, I mean, she was playing out, playing out back. Just simply broke many bones. She tripped over the... Fell down a hill. The, uh, Brought back up. Mike passes. One, two... Three, Jesus four. Christ, Justin. What's up? Did you shuffle these? I did. I did. <laughs> I was, that's why I was I was looking at the pile seeing what I would get. All right. I'm really glad. Lola Wellington Smythe, your time has come. <gasps> For you, instead of doing homework and studying, you played Oregon Trail. <laughs> and if there's one thing we know about video games is it turns your brain into mush. And That's she, the real reason no, I'm not here. <laughs> she had mush brain, and she was walking around, and the porcupine uh, platoon, as yes. Sylvia Lovehammer is calling it, were uh, watching her. She just walked into the woods, and poor Lola Wellington Smythe never returned. Oh, no. no. Mushy brain. Do you have a reaction? Cancel a discard an untimely death card sure. as it's played. Then in response, I will give this guy a plus 10. <laughs> uh, this one, sorry. Um... Was diverted by drink. She fell down a hill, and it hurts to break bones. Mm, of it, course does. it does. And there's not a lot of medicine around this time. Yeah, the butler must be stopped. Luckily, she didn't actually go into the woods. The butler pulled her out in time. Mm. Saved her. Um, he but luckily, did it. He, um, he wants to kill her. <laughs> the, the corpse girl uh, broke many bones, but luckily she was then diverted by drink, and everything was a okay. And discard one card from your hand. That's fine. Get rid of some of these. Oh, that card's a disgusting. That's it for me. Okay. So Balthazar. <laughs> okay. <laughs> back, back to Balthazar. <laughs> I'm taking these out one at a time. It's just easier yeah. that way. Yeah. <laughs> Stories are linear. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> After his mice militia attack, um, clearly all those bite wounds um, existed for a while, and he, he suffered from sores. Oh, God. Isn't that great? Oh, just that poor doggo. Excellent. And that dog is fucking so my, 45 <laughs> modifier. My draw limit is decreased by one card. Um, and... Oh, 
consequently, the old dam, you know, ruling with the iron fist, saw all this happening and, yep. you know, went out to try and stop the mice. Got a few bites herself and uh, they got infected. It wasn't so great. Um, and she was galled by gr- gangrene. Oh, no. Yeah, mm. Rip. Who likes to lose a limb? Not me. <laughs> Alright, well, there was a, a twist of fate. Ooh! And, uh. A twist. What a twist! Though Melissa <laughs> had a drink, the venue that she was at changed ever so slightly into a high school dance. Oh, that's nice! Oh. And she was a disgrace. <laughs> oh, disgraced at the dance. Nobody likes and to be. And then, bad for my second. Action. I'm going to say uh, Justin, your lovely butler. Yeah, he's a good guy. He he's was turning out to be one. He was there. He was there with Melissa Slogger. If you'll make him angry, I will make your people the happiest people in the world. Just so you know. <laughs> and, uh, and he took that drink from her. Sure. As she uh, got one responsible. And yeah. Probably this one. Yeah, that's it for me. Um, on Mr. Giggles' train ride back from, well, he was he he took a train back from from his holiday mm-hmm. that went horribly wrong, and he was so distraught over it. Um, the the train then crashed. Oh no! And he was trapped. Minus sixty, huh? On the train for a very long time. Who knows how long? That is definitely the one you should make happy. <laughs> Forget about poor Balthazar. No, Balthazar <laughs> also needs to become happy. <laughs> He's got way more points than me. <laughs> he does. Way so. more. I, I don't think so. <laughs> I can't keep. I can't keep all these families happy. Look at those two. Look at these two over here. Because if I keep your guys' family happy, then I just lose. <laughs> Uh, my... You can't let him get away with that, though. And I don't have any happy cards. I don't. <laughs> oh, I've already picked on Mike, so that's someone else's problem. I don't have <laughs> any happy cards. I can't help it. Yeah, but Caitlin's going before Mike. It's true. Um, I think i got to keep Balthazar. Nah, Balthazar's, I mean, 45 is really bad. I'm going to do... But Caitlin's also really well Thumbelisa. off. Thumbelisa. Yeah, she's almost, she's, she's got her two dead guys. Yeah. So. Thumbelina, you also have two or men. Plumbelisa, <laughs> was terrified by topiary. Ah, ah, I'm not sure what that is. It's, it's the shining. Shaped, it's shaped hedges. <laughs> you know, like when they're. It is the shining. Yeah. It's the shining. <laughs> okay. Um, Let's make up lost time. Don't ever stop, Brad. Uh, so she <sighs> she she went outside and obviously since she's so tiny, she was scared by these big. Cut Copiers. bushes. Yes, that were that, lions and coming. Yeah, they, 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 she, she thought they were real. As you do. Her, her rest of her circus has pretty much left her. He's strapped on a train. Samson's dead. We don't know where the ringmaster is. Just disappeared to thin air. Left. All right. You done, Mike? Yeah, I'm Drop done. Drop back up. We're at a crossroads, everybody. Because oh, I have a card that just fucks over one person. <laughs> Like, it just ruins You already your did day. that to me. I did. But the problem is, you've rebounded very well. Very I'm well. trying. I'm trying, yeah. <laughs> I need to know if anyone else can deal with Mike. I can't. I have nothing that's useful for dealing with him. You have one? Short sure of killing Mike? him off, which would be Because I feel helping. bad completely fucking... Because yeah, this would just... True. This would ruin you. So, so do now, to Caitlin, because she's the one who's going to play it on me. Yeah, I mean, like... This is <laughs> really good. 45 points. But Caitlyn already has 25 plus, she has 50. And I've only got, this one doesn't count for anything. That's true. That's f- there are 40. I mean, there this guy right one. here 40, is... 50, 65, 75. That's 90. I have not That's come across a card that can get rid of that yet. So, they exist. I don't know. I've got 45. I'm only at 95. I'm only five points ahead of her. All right, well, you still need to be stopped. That's so fair. We're doing that with three people. With three right? I'm, just, I'm just saying... <laughs> She still has one more person to start adding on. I have no more room. I have no death cards, though. It's true, she does. Yes, you do. You have it's not a death card. Pass. Oh, I thought only death cards nope. had rest it's in peace. Story. It's an event. It's an event. Event. 
<sighs> All right, well, you know what? Um, I'm just going to take yeah. a moment and go to my butler. Sounds good. He was drinking a lot and um, diverted by drink, so much so that he was driven to drink, but not in a good way. Not like, you know, I'm going to have a cooler with my buds, but in like a... I've had a bad day. Yeah, we need this butler to stop drinking. Had a bad life. <laughs> All right, so I need to figure out everyone's points again. So you have 95, you have 90. How much do you, you I have? I don't know anymore. You're going to kill somebody, though. 45, 60, plus 35, so... 95. 95 as well. I'm going to have to kill Balthazar. Fuck. In, like, a good way. Oh. A chance to begin again. This poor dog no. loses all of their cards. No! Nice. Sorry, oh. Balthazar. Poor Balthazar. He got happy. He got, he got a well, second chance. You know, he got less sad. That's really what happened. He healed. There was less sores. Yeah. Man, I had a really good way to kill him, too. Oof, really that's that's the only like reason, really good because story. I, I feel like you could have killed him before Caitlyn had a chance to kill that one, and hopefully... It's true. I would have. It was a great story. It really was. There were going to be things coming out of his sores. It was going to be great. Gross. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> now I'm going to re-plan some things. These cars look good on stream, though. Except the butler is kind of in the, the light zone, so he's very bright. Nice. He's a very bright guy. Yeah, no, he's not. He's dumb. Mm. That's why he drinks all the time. Much that, brain. that ruins the pun then. Yep. So that's good. Do you remember when your ringleader just left? Yeah, he, he walked left away. You. This one actually is discarded. That's fine. Okay. Mm I'm glad the clown's so sad. <laughs> so sad. He just tried to get happy, and everything just went wrong. Went wrong. Poor, poor clown. All right, so Balthazar, again, sniffing around the garden. <laughs> Balthazar, get out of the garden! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> he's just, you know, he's a dog. It's what they do. Ventures over to the neighbor's property. Um, it's this nice, like, little old lady, you know? She, she's, she's watching the dog through the window. <laughs> mm. Whole neighbors. Sure, sure. The professor watching Balthazar sniff around. And uh, Balthazar starts to, to sniff a little too close to uh, what was once one of her experiments that she buried in that yard. And uh, being the sort of witch doctor type lady that she is, she puts a curse on poor Balthazar. Oh, no. And cursed by a crone. Wow, roasted. She just called you a crone. <laughs> yeah, well, you know. My draw line is decreased by one card. Okay, yep. Okay, what else? Uh, I literally can do nothing else, so... Do you have a negative modifier that could potentially make this modifier not 40? No. Nope. Wow. I have nothing but death cards. Oh, shit. <laughs> and I have you can discard your hand as an action. Oh, can I? Yep. yep. Great, then I'm gonna do that. And then you draw four? four. Yeah. yeah. One, two, three, four. Here you go. Thanks. Caitlin! Wait. <laughs> That's funny. If you can stop the clown, stop the clown. <laughs> um, That's why I stopped the dog. So. Or at least hinder him. Yeah. Yeah. What's his name? Chuckles? Giggles. Mr. Giggles. Giggles. Mr. Giggles. On his, uh, on his train trip. He was trapped on the train. It crashed. Well, you he, know. He was trapped under it. It made it to a lake. Oh. He was trapped by a lake. And he found love. Aw, love of the lake. Perhaps, oh. perhaps by a, uh, a lovely rescue services. Yeah. 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 Ranger Judy. Yeah. Yeah. And, then, and then I just, I just can't, I can't Man, that really fucked that clown up. Yeah. He got happy fast. Real happy, real <laughs> That's what fast. love does, Mike. He's minus five now. It's 40. Alright. Down um, from 90. So, uh, Professor Helen is longer. Yep. Uh, the authorities came. I okay. found out what she was doing to whoever this brain used to belong to, <laughs> and her daughter, and her husband. And, uh, she went to jail. Oh, no! Oh, man, jail sucks. You can't get out of jail easily. You cannot play events cards. Okay. Oh. Mike! Nope, nope. nope. Oh. Oh, she just... On a pile. Hmm. Yep. Mm. You're up, Mike. Yeah. How's it going, Bill? Bill, does anyone in real life call you Bill Nye the Science Guy? Because I imagine that would get annoying pretty quick if people did. 
Yeah. Where people do that to you when you walk into the room. I mean, that's also probably annoying and awesome, depending on your we mood. Had a, we had a friend when I was in uh, college, <laughs> not Ridgely College, but further on in, in Ontario. Yes. Yeah. That any time he walked into a room, we would chant his name. Nice. <laughs> and so it was just pop. Oh, Amazing. He dropped him. He loved it, but also it kind of drove him a little crazy. Oh, yeah. oh Mike is looking to snipe oh, one of these. No. One of this red family. Um, Sniped. Man, Balthazar really recovered to being sad. Recovered. To being sad, yeah. Yeah. Um, so after she was disgraced at the dance, yeah. it actually made her go mad with all her weird things. The teenager. Complex. The teenager combined with that she was brought back from the dead. Yeah, this is weird, right? So does it do zone card from your hand every oh, time? Oh, you play monitor. Yeah. Oh, so do I have to discard no, one? No, she does. Yeah. So you discard a card, yeah. And anytime she plays one that does something else. Uh, okay. Yeah. And uh, Mr. Giggles, well, on at this lake, yeah. found love. Oh, okay. And as he went up to it, it wasn't. It? The, the lady. It wasn't a lady. That he oh, fell in love with. It. Got it, and it was a manatee, and he actually got mauled by it. A manatee? <laughs> Do you get mauled by a manatee? It just like lays on you. <laughs> <laughs> he he got really close to it before he realized it was a manatee. So not usually, but it has happened before. All right, Mike skips his draw <laughs> step. All right, I'm gonna kill somebody. If you guys um, want to stop, no. you can. But I'm just gonna kill this butter butler. Butter. Because he's a fucking asshole. I thought you were gonna kill him last. I know, yeah, but, but like I have synergy, and that. Mm -hmm. Outweighs flavor, right? It's fair, it's fair. I mean, the flavor is really good on this because he was eating a Subway sandwich. Well, that is flavorful. Was he? he was drunk as fuck, mm -hmm. and he was no. like, "I'm gonna go buy a sub, and I'm gonna eat it." He's got some weird he, cravings. He, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he got a, you know, what's in my brain? That's what's happening. He got a meatball sub, but halfway through there was a giant bone in it. Oh no! And he choked on a bone. Oh no! Fucking Sue Subway. Died. Just, uh, if died anybody, first. if anybody needs to be choking on a bone. It's the oh, dog. Okay. <laughs> Come on now. What is I'm going to throw my hand away and draw one, two, three, four. Or her, but in a much nastier way. Hello. <laughs> Ooh, guys, don't let it get to my turn again, because you guys are all going to get fucked. Just <laughs> super happy. I'll draw one more card. Five. Yep, I'm, an, I'm the happy hand now, just so everybody knows. They were all at the bottom? Yep. That's great. Yeah. That's awesome. He must have had that chicken sub that was only 50% chicken. But like the other half was like, the other 50% is like soy, right? Like that was the big revelation about Subway chicken sandwiches. Yeah. I mean, what's wrong with eating soy? It's actually apparently really good for you. Yeah, I, I eat soy all the time. I mean, I've been, I'm dating a vegetarian. All we eat is fucking soy and tofu, and it's great. I hate tofu. I love tofu. I, I like dessert. Tofu, tofu has to be right. Yeah, tofu, it, I've had it wrong, and I've had it right. There's some really good, actually, pre-smoked tofu we can get at like Safeway. Mm -hmm. You know, it's I just, pretty good. James gave me some tofu when we were streaming Pathfinder once. He was like, yeah, it's so good. Was it deep-fried? I hate deep-fried tofu. There's some good deep fried tofu. I've had very good deep fried tofu. But also it's James, and I don't think he gets good tofu. No, if it's from an Asian place, it's usually deep fried, and it's really soft and squishy, and it's not. It might have been, I don't know. I hated it, it was gross. Yeah. All right. Barbecue tofu is good, sorry. So the old dam heard about the professor's scandalous jail time, and started gossiping with the rest of the neighborhood. You know, yeah. like, <laughs> as we do. As we do. Um, and the, the, the tales they told just got bigger and bigger and bigger. And you know, one day what she started is like a little gossip got back to her and she was scarred by the scandals. Oh, shit. She was super scarred. So I get to discard my entire hand. And then draw. And then draw. draw four new cards at the end of your turn? Four, yeah. Cool. Caitlin, you're up. Yeah. You're right, they all were at the bottom. Happy, happy, happy. This, this, this town's about to get a hell of a lot happier. The other 50% was additives. You know? It's always an additive. But I am never surprised that they're like, fast food restaurant isn't food. I'm like, yeah. We know that. Yeah. We got that. So, Thanks. Poor Melissa. Oh, no, she died. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Careful. <laughs> careful. <laughs> You're good. Yeah, we're good. Disgraced by the dance. Yeah, okay. So, uh, she was disgraced. And she, uh, she went running out of the dance. Uh, mad. Mildly mad. mad. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, well, this poor bitch was eaten by bears in the woods behind the store. <laughs> Fuck. 
What a way to go. Oh, man. Especially when you're mad and, and disgraced. And, All right, can we... Uh, and then... Um, what's she at? I don't know. It, it, it's too much. More than me. <laughs> Mine are all small numbers, actually. <laughs> too much. Uh, and then Professor Helen is longer. Uh, well, while she was in jail, she was be- greeted by ghosts. Oh, spooky. Discard those. And it's the right, here you go. Draw two, then I'll two. shuffle all these together. Oops. I have cards in my hand. Three. Cool, see what I should do with my hand. All right. You're looking at this family for? <laughs> um, just, just looking, just browsing the neighborhood. Right. You know? Thumbelisa. Keeping up with the Joneses. Thumbelisa, as she, when she was scared by the bushes, yep. she went running into the town square. Since she's she's really tiny, yep. and everyone just thought she was a weird bird. A, a weird, and they didn't like it, and they. They they burnt her. Oh, she no. was burnt at the stake by a mob. Oh, snap. And then Oh, he's ending the game this turn. No. <laughs> and then uh, no. Mr. Giggles. No. After he was uh, yep, mauled by a manatee. Yep. He uh, he rolled over into a uh, a weasel. Oh shit. Den and they devoured him. Can anybody and can anybody stop that? No, I only have no. good cards in my hand. And by good, I mean, like, happiness. I only have an event card that affects a living person, so... All right, let's calculate this. We got Justin, Mike, Megan, Kate. I love crackling. So close. All right, I definitely did not. I have 15. I have 15, 20, so 35. Plus 10 is 45. 50, I have 60, so... My numbers are much smaller. Megan, what about you? Oh, God. So that's... It doesn't sound like phone static. Okay, I'll keep an eye on it. Is it only of your dead people, or is it everybody? It's only dead people. Oh, okay. Well, in that yeah. case, I have 25. Good. Okay. Man, your family was really happy. That's good, right? Well, they weren't happy. They were right, a lot. Um, <laughs> I had 30, 50, 60, 70, 80. 80. Yeah. Man, I had such good plans to screw All right. everyone up. Yeah, me too. I was going <laughs> to drop a bunch of happy bombs. All right, Mike. I got 40, 60, 75, uh, 60. 60? Sweet! Minus 60. Caitlin wins! Nice. Ooh, had it was close. I counted up and I was... I oh, st- sorry. I got 10 and 10. Plus 10 more. I'm at 80. Tie? 80. Tie. What happens in the case of a tie? Nice. I forgot about this are both team. miserable. Just terrible. We're just miserable. both miserable. That... The other death card I was planning to use on him before you put the other one on him. I it would he would have been sixty plus. Yeah, you guys both win. Yeah. Nice. There's nothing that no. breaks ties. No, there you go. We're just both miserable. Just both sad. Equally miserable. I counted her points and it was very close to mine. Yeah. And I was like, I might as well just end it. I might as well not let it go around again. Because yeah. I had oh no, I got rid of it. I had one that was fifteen, fifteen, fifteen. But it was like yours. It was discard your entire hand and yeah, but yeah, if, if if he wouldn't have got that on it, then he would have got this death card, which was plus 10 for a heart, so he'd have been minus <laughs> 70. You let you keep that yeah. No, I know. The only way you can play that one is if you have one of those story cards that's like, slip any modifier in under on a dead character. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's true. That's gloom. That is. You know, I think gloomy. we should spin the wheel. <gasps> sure. We can probably spin the wheel. I mean... Spin the wheel. What's the worst that can happen? Uh, Burgle Bros, Dream Aspect. I, I've never played Burgle Bros, so I mean, wouldn't be unhappy. Pretty bad. <laughs> I think the only. But Chad wants to see it, obviously. It's very dusty. We need to rewrite this again. <laughs> oh, Skittle Party. <laughs> cool. It's cool. Nice. Making foreshadow of it. Nice foreshadowing. It was the only one I knew. I think. Mm. Yep. No, you just don't play right? Oh, I know Seven Wonders, but I, I, it's way too complicated for me to understand. <laughs> seven Wonders is easy. I disagree. <laughs> yeah, it's true. I mean, I've never played... You have the cloth on that side? Mm. Oh, Caitlin. 
I've never played Burgle Bros 100% right. That is true, but even with the corrections, I've rather I would rather just play Pandemic because what? I just don't like I Burgle moved. Bros. And I thought I saw the thing move, but Justin was talking. I thought maybe my practice crackled. Oh, okay. What's that? A pack crackle? You guys are lag. I don't know what that means, Chad. Is that a threat? We're lag. Oh, 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 got it, saved it. Whoa, that was crazy. Seven Wonders is hard to understand your first time. I, hate it. I agree. Yeah, it's hard. very hard to play your first you time. You know what I hate more than Seven Wonders? Seven Wonders Duel. That's actually the only version I've tried to play, which is, I'm sure, way worse than the regular one. It was complicated. It was at a board game it cafe. It was might just be the time. only